Hey, good morning, guys. This is Stephen Howard. My dog, Yucca and Rio, are back at camp with Lori. Uh, a little bit of prayers for Lori. She's been feeling pretty sick the past couple of days. Uh, congestion and cough, sore throat, all of the above. Um, when things get hard, uh, you got to keep pushing. You got to keep pushing through when you don't want to get up in the morning and you're sore and tired and you're in your second week and waiting for a paycheck. You got to get up and you got to keep on going, put your best foot forward, uh, keep on trying and don't give up. When things aren't, aren't going your way, uh, you know, you do some work and it's new to you. So, so give yourself a little bit of slack, but don't screw up. You got to, you got to try and make it right make it look right, make it feel right. Um, put in the extra effort because it will pay off when other people look at your work. Uh, beautiful sunrise this morning. It's partly cloudy, been raining. Sorry about my windshield. It's a Montana windshield. Um, divinely guided message that I got was that, you know, hang in there because it's right around the corner. Everything you've ever dreamed about is right around the corner. And I know that we're all tired of hearing that, but we've been pushing so hard and staying on on path and not allowing our shadow side to take over uh, not letting addictions and negative vibrations and all those things to take over and you can see when it's taking over on other people you can actually start to see it because you're on path so definitely let's uh let's stay on path let's you know, we have to understand our dark side, our negative side, and all of the negative thoughts are there. We just have to, you know, kill the ants, kill the automatic negative thoughts. And you might have a positive, a very positive tower moment someday soon uh, where you're like, wow, I, I don't have to worry anymore. I don't have to you know, always be concerned where my next meal or my next tank of gas is coming from. And uh, wouldn't that be nice? So also all the debts, all the little things that stack up on you and all the people you wish you could pay back, you know. Imagine if you could pay all them back today. Imagine if you could, uh, you know, relinquish all the worry and all of the things you know, it wouldn't take that much. And um, you get into a, a new place to live, you know, I'm trying to find a really nice trailer uh, and find the right fit and the right place to be and staying on vibration. Things should go really, really awesome this year for people who are staying on path. Anyway, I love you guys. I miss my dogs. I I miss you, Lori. I hope you're feeling better. And, uh, yeah, we just got to keep on keeping on. Uh, you know, when the going gets rough, uh, the tough get going. And uh, I'm pretty tough at this point. I think, uh, you know, when I'm driving sometimes in the morning, I think about several years ago when I was driving up here on a motorcycle I'd wake up early in the morning, it'd be super cold, and I'd break camp, and I'd start riding again, and I, I had never been to Missoula before, so it's been quite an incredible journey. If you, if you go back two or three years in videos, and you watch one of those videos, and then you watch me today, you'll see, you'll actually see the improvement and what I've been through and what's going on, you know, it, it's, it's been amazing. So, uh, you know, keep, keep on keeping on, realize that, you know, everybody's journey is different and we're all going through hard stuff at different times. 
Uh, I just pray for my family. I pray for everybody involved. And um, I pray for, for the miracle that's about to arrive and uh, that things will get so much better. Um, you know, money doesn't, doesn't help everything. It can't help you emotionally. Um, it can't, it can't help you with your love life. It can't help <coughs> with a lot of things, but what it can do is it can provide you with stability and that can help with those things. So, uh, just remember, you know, the reason why we, we are all going to work and working so hard. Uh, I kind of, as I'm going up the highway, I acknowledge all the other workers. You can tell, tell who they are by their vehicles, Montana vehicles, a little bit of rust, a little bit of patina, a lot of craftsmanship. I hope you guys have an awesome day. Uh, I love you guys. Uh, I think that's about it. Shoots.